Today's video is a little bit different. Today I'm going out to people and asking them to share their hearts about the world, what they believe the world to be. So curiosity and openness is my main emotion. How would you describe the world? The world is very sad at the moment. Too much aggression and pain. There's a lot of good in the world, but there's also a lot of evil. At the moment, I think it's quite a scary place. Quite an uncomfortable place to be in at the moment, but um, hopefully things will get a bit better. I think it's currently in turmoil. Right. There's uh, huge rifts in the world at the moment between religion mainly. Uh, and also countries, I think it's all being stirred up. The, the world, I think, is quite a sad place with everything that's going on at the moment. Concerns with the environment, uh, possible destruction of the world in, in future, future time. Uh, confused, got some really good people, some really bad people, yeah. broken. With all the things that are going on at the moment, and all right. the things that are happening, particularly in Belgium, I think the whole world has got a whole lot of problems, which is very difficult to see an answer to. Very dangerous place at the moment with all this terrorism going on. A bit weary about travelling abroad. I think today the world is very confused. People have very different views. Uh, some take pleasure in killing others. Others are very philanthropic. How would you describe the world? Insanely cruel. Um, um, and beautiful at the same time. How would you describe the world? Well, it's uh, currently sad, unfortunately. Um, there's still good in the world, it's just uh, uh, not many people are still seeing it because of the bad right. that is happening in the world. Uh, currently, with the, the grow of mass media and things like that, has right. been we are able to see more perspectives of the world and what's going on in the world. Mm -hmm to a much higher degree, which makes people a lot more pessimistic. Uh -huh. But also, I think, in contrary to that, it can make people a lot more optimistic. For me, the world is an organism, a living organism. It has to be uh, connected in the same way. We are all one. I am here with... Richard Navarro. Nice to meet you. How would you describe the world? <laughs> Have you seen the shadows oh. of the midday sun? The wild meadows where the geckos run. Have you seen the oyster with a stone for a pearl? Have you seen it lately? Have you seen my world? I think the world is whatever you want it to be. It's right. all about taking the opportunities that come towards you and also being respectful for one another. No matter what race, what gender, what sexuality, whatever, it's all about respect. Come together, we can solve things. But it's when we don't come together that we have the issues. The world is a beautiful place. People are all very friendly and nice and warm. There's a lot of beautiful nature around the world that is unexplored. The world is beautiful. I love the world. I think the world's fantastic. It's, it's absolutely fantastic, but people are messing it up. Right. That's my view of the world. I think the world itself, when people say, I hate the world, I think right. that's wrong. The world is fantastic, wonderful, beautiful place. Yeah, exactly. People make it less so. Right. But we do have potential to make it amazing. It was blue as moonstone, green as nebula, the boom, boom, a whitewash shoreline, beneath the boom, a welded sky, do 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 boom, and we watched the waters, as they rose and they swam. See, have you seen it anywhere? Have you seen my world? Beautiful world. Revolutionary. Joy. Happiness. Inspiring. Beautiful. Aggressive. Troubled. In need for peace. Unity. Beauty and destruction. Savable. Beautiful. Infinite. Turmoil. Hope. Confused. Beautiful. Potential. Complex. Human. 